Who says, let's visit Turkey? Hi, I'm Dalma, and today I will teach you how to get a Turkey e-visa online fast and easy. Turkey is definitely one of the destinations in our bucket list and now that summer's here, you wouldn't want to miss it. Just picture yourself in a hot air balloon with a spectacular view of Cappadocia, doing paragliding over the Blue Lagoon, or visiting Istanbul, or drinking tea and playing tafla as a local. These are only a few of the top activities that you can do in Turkey. I bet you already feel there, don't you? Well, do not let a visa stop you from visiting this amazing destination. But before you start breaking your head thinking about how you'll get that visa, just let me tell you that this one can be done completely and 100% online. So let's just start with some info. The Turkey e-visa is available through a simple online process for travelers of over 40 countries. There are, however, an additional 60 countries that can apply for an e-visa, but they must meet certain additional requirements, such as having a valid visa or residence permit from the Schengen area, Ireland, United Kingdom, or the United States. And if you're just transiting through the airport, just know that there's no need to get this document. The maximum stay for your Turkey e-visa ranges from 30 days to 90 days in total. This depending on your nationality, of course. And its validity is 180 days after arrival. But Dalma, what is the difference between the maximum stay and the validity? The maximum stay is the number of days that you can be in Turkey and the validity means how long you can use your visa for. So imagine that you have a trip planned this month and you're going there for two weeks. That's under the maximum stay limit and your visa is still valid for you to enter a second time because you still have 166 days left. Now. The e-visa for Turkey can be a single or multiple entry visa depending on your nationality. So you should read carefully all the information that's provided on the application page. The Turkey e-visa is only valid for tourism purposes and short business trips. No medical reasons allowed. Finally, let's talk about price. This will also depend on your nationality. For example, if you're a Canadian passport holder, the government fee will be 61 American dollars and 50 cents. But if you are from the US, it will be $10 less. Even for some nationalities, this e-visa can be completely free. So if you want to calculate the cost of your e-visa, just go to www.ivisa.com slash turkey dash turkish dash visa and scroll down until you find our calculator tool. Now place your nationality, the number of travelers, and the type of visa. You can also change the currency to see the amount in your own. Now let's move to the required documents for the application. You will only need a passport scan with your personal details, supporting documents such as your visa or residence permit from Schengen, the US or the UK and Ireland if requested. To apply for this document, you can A, do it yourself or B, let an expert do it for you. So let's start with the self-application. Go to www.evisa.gov.tr and click on the Apply Now box. It will take a few minutes to load, but once that's done, you'll be redirected to the Start page. Two, place your nationality. We are going to try with Philippines here. Now select your travel document, which can be your ordinary passport, and write the code you see in the box. Click Save and Continue. Three, now choose your arrival date in Turkey. You will see the validity and max stay of your visa below. Also, the number of entries and the government fee. Now click save and continue. Four, now a prerequisites list will appear. You must meet all of those requirements or you will not be able to continue. Five, 
Now you must fill all your personal details. If your nationality requires a supporting document, you will also need to fill in the information on this page. Six, once you've filled in all the gaps, hit save and continue. Now an email will be sent to you to confirm your email address. Seven, once that validation is done, you will be able to pay. This transaction will be made in dollars and you can do it using multiple payment methods. Now this information will be reviewed by an immigration officer and approved or denied if there's any sort of mistake within the application. Doesn't seem that hard, does it? Seems pretty easy, is it though? If you have any doubts so far, make sure to leave it in the comments and hit the like button below to just keep going. So maybe the Turkey government page does not seem to be fully impossible to navigate. But if you're one of those who want to be reassured that your visa won't be denied, doing the visa process with an expert will be definitely your best choice. In order to do this, you only need to visit ivisa.com, place your nationality, and then simply hit Turkey as your destination. The first page will display all the information you need to know. You will also be able to change language and currency to any of your preference. Now, as the first step, start running your application by clicking apply now. Two, just choose the document you're applying for. Then an important information link will appear. Now click on it and you'll see all the details regarding your visa. Three, place your email and let's just keep going. Four, add the estimated dates for your trip as well as your phone number. In case your dates exceed the limit, an error message will appear giving you the information and letting you know. Five, add your personal information and hit continue. Six, now select the time for your visa to be delivered. This will add an extra service fee for the revision and processing of your visa. Seven, then you will be able to add the health declaration if your nationality needs one. A health declaration is a mandatory document that's made to prevent the spread of COVID in the region. Eight, finally, review your info and pay. You are able to choose between multiple payment methods here as well. And yes, that's it. Now your information will be sent to one of our iVisa experts at iVisa.com so it can be reviewed. And in case there's something that needs to be corrected, we will be contacting you as soon as possible before we run your application through the government's page. Also, if you have selected the health declaration option, both documents will be delivered directly to you within the selected time frame, which means that you will not need to run a different process to acquire this document. And last but not least, you will also be able to track the process in your personal account, so you will always get updates in real time about your visa. And that's it for this video. If you found it useful, subscribe to our channel and share this video with all your travel buddies. Also, let us know in the comments which other visas you would like us to talk about. Safe travels! Mm -hmm.